huge milestone for the project today. This is the delivery of the last module to APLNG. It's a really important milestone for the project because it's taken a huge amount of work. The modules, of course, are a huge component of the planet itself here on Curtis Island. And without that, very little of the other work can progress. So as the modules have been coming in over the last year and a half, we've been able to progress different work fronts. And with the last module arriving now, that's the final piece in the jigsaw, and we can continue all the work through to completion. The module program overall was only two years and in that time we've created 69 modules and shipped them to site. Uh, it really is changing the landscape of Curtis Island now as the plant comes out of the ground and, uh, and takes shape. And the first module is always the biggest challenge of course, getting that first one on the water complete and ready to go because that really tests the whole system, puts the whole team through that rigour of getting something completed and shipped and then on the way. And then the second major milestone really was, was the shipment of the first cryo module uh, for Train 1. This was the first major module, 3,200 tonnes. Uh, and here we are at the end of 2014 with the last module shipped from the module yard. This is a great opportunity just to say thank you to everyone in Batam. That team, as I say, more than 4,500 people at peak and, and many of our colleagues and friends were there for more than two years setting up, pushing the work, completing it and of course completing it safely. So huge credit to the whole team in Batam. They did a fantastic job for the project and the project here on Curtis Island wouldn't be successful if they hadn't been successful.